I am your brother in Christ, and we are back with the coronavirus once again. No, I do not have it. That's just how we started up. Um, unfortunately, I did not do a video yesterday because my wife has, at least we believe she has, uh, bronchitis. So I had to run in and get her some medicine for that. But let's start off with a shameless plug. First of all, this Sunday will be our live stream. It'll be covering uh, tips and tricks on making videos, how to make them, or how to stream. Um, there are some real big differences in between those two, and I've done both for quite some time. So we'll cover that. I'll give you guys some advice on how to do that. We'll also be covering sin, damnation, and hell, as well as God's master plan. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe the video. And also join us on all the social medias, most notably Minds, Gab, YouTube, and BitChute. And also support us on Patreon if you enjoy these sort of videos. And also share us so we can increase awareness on what the heck is going on with this virus. So without further ado, let's take a look at the numbers. So far worldwide, we have 1 million active cases. And... 87,830 dead. Now that does include China's numbers, so I'm questioning if China's numbers are accurate. I think they're much, much higher than what we assume, but then again, we might have asymptomatic people, so the overall active cases might be much higher too. We just don't know until we get that antibody test. So let's take a look at what states are currently under lockdown. We see our original map here, hadn't changed in a while, but there has been a few changes. We see that South Carolina, Alabama, Missouri, and Texas have joined us in our full lockdown. Um, we still have a lot of the middle America that's still not got, going along with the guidelines. We'll see how long they continue to hold out as far as being fully open. Let's take a look at the numbers for the United States. We are seeing 385,392 active cases. That is up 52,900 from our last video. Deaths have climbed to 14,442. That is up 3,705 from our last video. In Alabama, we see 2,283 active cases. This is up 356. Deaths have climbed to 66. That's up 14. In Alaska, we see 187 active cases. This is up 17. Deaths have climbed to 7. That's up 1. In Arizona, we see 2,626 active cases. That is up 255. Deaths have climbed to 80. That's up 15. In Arkansas, we see 781 active cases. This is up 24. Deaths have climbed to 18. That's up 2. In California, we see 16,419 active cases. That is up 1,868. Deaths have climbed to 456. That is up 84. In Colorado, we see 5,210 active cases. That is up 440. Deaths have climbed to 179. That is up 39. In Connecticut, we see 7,454 active cases. That is up 804. Deaths have climbed to 277. That is up 71. In Delaware, we see 768 active cases. That is up 71. Deaths have climbed to 16. That's up 1. In Washington, D.C., we see 1,052 active cases. That is up 237. Deaths have climbed to 27. That is up 3. In Florida, we see 15,047 active cases. That is up 2,059. Deaths have climbed to 309. That is up 73. In Georgia, we see 9,508 active cases. That is up 2,454. Deaths have climbed to 362. That is up 133. In Hawaii, we see 292 active cases. This is down 1. Deaths are holding steady at 5. 
In Idaho, we see 1,195 active cases. This is up 104. Deaths have climbed to 15. That's up 5. In Illinois, we see 14,566 active cases. This is up 2,661. Deaths have climbed to 462. That is up 155. In Indiana, we see 5,726 active cases. This is up 935. Deaths have climbed to 203. That is up 64. In Iowa, we see 1,029 active cases. That is up 176. Deaths have climbed to 27. That's up 2. In Kansas, we see 881 active cases. That is up 61. Deaths have climbed to 31. That's up 6. In Kentucky, we see 778 active cases. That is up 135. Deaths have climbed to 65. That's up 6. In Louisiana, we see 16,328 active cases. This is up 2,023. Deaths have climbed to 652. That is up 140. In Maine, we see 336 active cases. That is up 5. Deaths have climbed to 14. That's up 4. In Maryland, we see 5,117 active cases. That is up 1,347. Deaths have climbed to 124, that's up 33. In Massachusetts, we see 14,836 active cases, that is up 1,269. Deaths have climbed to 356, that is up 96. In Michigan, we see 19,318. That is up 2,893. Deaths have climbed to 959. That is up 232. In Minnesota, we see 483 active cases. That's down 3. Deaths are now at 39. That is up 9. In Mississippi, we see 1,936 active cases. That is up 249. Deaths have climbed to 67. That's up 16. In Missouri, we see 3,179 active cases. That is up 521. Deaths have climbed to 79. That is up 27. In Minnesota, we see 191 active cases. That's down 70. Deaths are holding steady at 6. In Nebraska, we see 507 active cases. That is up 106. Deaths have climbed to 12. That's up 4. In Nevada, we see 2,109 active cases. That is up 238. Deaths have climbed to 71. That's up 25. In New Hampshire, we see 583 active cases. That's up 70. Deaths have climbed to 13. That's up 4. In New Jersey, we see 45,814. That is up 5,846. Deaths have climbed to 1,504. That is up 501. In New Mexico, we see 610 active cases. That is up 52. Deaths have climbed to 13. That's up 1. In New York, we see 128,468 active cases. That is up 15,903. Deaths have climbed to 6,268. That is up 1,510 from our last video. Since I released my last video, over 1,510 people have died in New York. Wow. In North Carolina, we see 3,305 active cases. That is up 521. Deaths have climbed to 59. That's up 16. In North Dakota, we see 149 active cases. That's up 1. Deaths have climbed to 4. That's up 1. 
In Ohio, we see 4,955 active cases. That is up 647. Deaths have climbed to 193. That's up 51. In Oklahoma, we see 923 active cases. That is up 30. Deaths have climbed to 79. That's up 28. In Oregon, we see 1,148 active cases. That is up 45. Deaths have climbed to 33. That's up 4. In Pennsylvania, we see 15,795 active cases. That is up 3,042. Deaths have climbed to 310. That's up 144. In Rhode Island... Ew. In Rhode Island, we see 1,405 active cases. That is up 360. Deaths have climbed to 35. That's up 8. In South Carolina, we see 2,489 active cases. That is up 305. Deaths have climbed to 63. That's up 15. In South Dakota, we see 241 active cases. That is up 48. Deaths have climbed to 6. That's up 2. In Tennessee, we see 3,817 active cases. That is up 436. Deaths have climbed to 79. That's up 14. In Texas, we see 8,551 active cases. That is up 2,050. Deaths have climbed to 178. That's up 34. In Utah, we see 1,807 active cases. That is up 165. Deaths are holding steady at 13. In Vermont, we see 582 active cases. That is up 62. Deaths are holding steady at 23. In Virginia, we see 3,568 active cases. That is up 746. Deaths have climbed to 75. That's up 21. In Washington, we see 7,731 active cases. That is up 924. Deaths have climbed to 407. That is up 69. In West Virginia, we see 458 active cases. That's up 117. Deaths are holding steady at 4. In Wisconsin, we see 2,655 active cases. That is up 294. Deaths have climbed to 99. That's up 22. In Wyoming, we see 169 active cases. That's up 11. Deaths are holding steady at zero. Thank God for that. So that is the situation around the United States. I will continue to give you guys updates as this continues. I do want to remind you guys that this will continue to get worse before it gets better. But we are definitely seeing that it's starting to plateau off. Um, we're starting to see the curve, instead of being exponential, we're starting to see it level off, which is great. Um, we're hoping that that is really the signs of this going away. And then we can get back to our regular lives, hopefully before too much longer, because our economy will crash pretty badly. We're already taking a huge hit as is. So, please let me remind you guys, please subscribe, support us on the social medias. And I will be with you guys throughout this entirety of this pandemic that we're dealing with. And as always, God be with us.